Hello everybody, my name is Trevor Slescu and I'm the owner of Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. Well, here we are, our second race car night of our 1964 AC Cobra, Corvette and Cheetah Slot Car League. And we're down here at the San Air Super Speedway in Quebec, Canada. Now let's go down and check out our race. Is everyone ready? Yeah. yeah. I wasn't. <laughs> Are you ready? Yep. Five, four, three, I need that. two, one. I <laughs> right, look at that. So, for those that are watching the video, we have some new computer software we're experimenting with tonight. Keep track of everybody's laps and let them know who's where. This is different from the other thing you were showing me. Yeah, it is. All right. Ow, I hate you, whoever that was. Now I gotta crawl around the computer. <laughs> Oops. Josh is first. I'll squeak around you. Howard third. Josh is fourth. Oh, actually. Oh, nice one. That's going I know. It's just we're using this as a timer to try out. Our number I destroyed the, the wing on that one. Three changes. Josh is first, we went second. Oh! Oh! Good drive. Just out of my hand there. Hey, who's got the oil on my trap? <laughs> so we got cheetahs. What happened to the. Uh, well, we got our oh. So this league is uh, cheetahs, corvettes, and cobras. And these are all unpainted. <laughs> so good. Dale's got those hot rod Carreras, some old stock. Walk away quite even on the lease. <laughs> Stephen took lead on Josh. Yeah, nice. yeah I, I got I caught up with him and uh, lapped him. Slingshots. <laughs> Two minutes left. Stephen's first, Josh is second. I was about to be. Nice, good work, Stephen. Well, oh, Josh took his lead back. Josh just took over first. <coughs> <laughs> what? Fight me? Josh just took over first. Yeah. How'd that happen? It was passive. You did? <laughs> yeah, you were standing still. You gotta speed up. <laughs> pretty girls. <laughs> I hope no one here just got in drag or anything. <laughs> Josh is first, Stephen second. Oh, <laughs> Stephen took over. <laughs> All right. That's <laughs> fine. Oh, oh, get him on, get him on. Done, Dale. Done. You're out? Well. Yeah. No, 
<laughs> so how it's gonna end up winning? I think I might have sorted. I, I, I fishtailed out of here and came out. <laughs> so I hit three again. I went from third to first. Thirty seconds left. You keep going. You could lap us, right? Oh, Howard's leader. Okay, everybody's up with Howard. So let's look at how this. Uh... Yeah, keep going. You could, you could get the lap count on this and get into second or third. You failed, there we go. Josh. You failed. You could get out fourth and go to third if you get the laps in. Before Eight seconds. Seven seconds. <laughs> five, four, three, two, one. Over. Howard has won the race. <laughs> <laughs> Howard has won the race. Howard has won the race. Okay. Good one, Howard. Wave your arms and stuff. Yeah. All right. <laughs> okay, so here we are at our board at the end of the San Air race. And I'm actually going to backtrack to last week because I had kidney stones, so the, the guys took care of the records and I didn't really get caught up here. Now, if I've got the records correct this row should be okay for Edmonton International so I was here but couldn't race um, and I got 34 at San Air Matt got 45 and 42 Stephen got 29 and 27 Devin got 33 and 31 Mark got 24 and 26 Kevin didn't show but got 26 at San Air Fred got 30 and 22 at San Air Dale got 51 in Edmonton and 41 at San Air. Mike didn't show for Edmonton, but got 32 at San Air. Josh got 22 in Edmonton and 31 at San Air. Alan didn't show for Edmonton, but got 20 at San Air. Roger got 13 and 22, and Howard got 29 and 45. So now if we look at the standings, I'm in 10th place with 34 points. Matt is 2nd with 87. Stephen is 5th with 56, Devin is 4th with 64, Mark is 8th with 50, Kevin is 12 with 26, Fred is in 7th place with 52, Dale is in 1st again with 92, Mike is in 11th place with 32, Josh is in 6th place with 53, Alan is in 13th with 20, Roger is in 9th place with 35, and Howard is in third with 74. And our next race, our last one in Canada, is going to be in Edenville. Edenvale, sorry. And then Sebring, USA, Lime Rock, Watkins Glen, <laughs> Autodrome Hernandez Rodriguez, Autodrome de Monterey, and Autodrome de Leon. So I hope you can join us for those races in our Pan American 1964 sports car series. And we will see you soon. And here we are at the end of the video. We're going to examine how I built the track so you too can build it in your own home. Okay, so we have our tables still set up in the big rectangle with the additional wood tables at the back. And our start finish gate is, you can see the crack coming down the table, pretty much center to the two tables. So there's our start finish gate. So we have one, two, three, four, five straights, and then two 1 60s. Of course, it's four lanes, so you're going to have your four 2 30s. And then we got a straight, and then we have a 90 degree turn here a 1 60 and a 1 30. Then we have a straight with our cross. And we come all the way over here, <laughs> and we've got our 1-30 for a little turn, and then two straights, and I put the chicane there, and then we have another 1-30 and a 2-60, a 1 quarter, and then the upside down of the 1-30, 2-30, and then we have a straight and a 1 quarter, then we get this 90 degree turn here for a 1-30 and a 1-60 for 90. Then here we have used the R2 and R3 setup. So we have one, two, three of the R3s, then two straights, one, two, three R3s on the outer, a straight, a quarter, and a straight. 
And then one, two, three are threes. And then one, two, three, four, five, six straights. And then I start finish gate. So if we pull this back here, you can see that our straightaway goes from one end of the table all the way to the other. And then we get into our turns. Now this is was quite a reach on the race night because there's pretty much, you know, three feet in between there. Then we get into the long turn here. This is almost a, a big square. And back to the start finish gate. And that's how you build this track. Hope this video helped you and I hope you can recreate this in your own space.